Up, up. Here, the red rat snake kept attacking. God, they're real lungy, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> Fortunately, he's not venomous. Yeah. Jesus. Since he bit our cameraman, Mark Laganga. <laughs> Enjoy seeing the 60 Minutes cameraman get bit instead of me. But the next snake was extremely venomous. Is that the spitter? Yeah, yeah. yeah. The Palauan spitting cobra can blind you if it spits in your eye, right. and it can spit 10 feet. Okay. That's why Joel wore goggles. But watch how close he gets to this cobra. I always thought when they had their hood out like that, that that meant danger. Well, he's reacting to us. We're like skyscrapers to this guy. So he's going to stand up and look as big as he can. They have a space prepped already. In zoos, Sartori can shoot more than 20 species in one day. In the wild, it could take several days to get one good shot. Now, with natural habitats vanishing, some species can only be found in zoos. A lot of them only exist in zoos. They have these captive breeding programs for some of the rarest animals in the world. So when people say, well, they're down on zoos, well, they haven't seen a good zoo, and they don't know the conservation effect of good zoos. 